Hi guys, Elle here from Winslow Skincare. So today I'm gonna to do my guide to exfoliants. So this is a video that a lot of my clients have asked me about. I go through this, I think, every day with clients. Um, every time I get a new client in, every time I have a consultation, whether it be in person or over video, I always, always talk about exfoliation. It is the one thing that you can do at home, that we can do in clinic, that is gonna make an instant visible change to your skin. So understanding the different types of exfoliants and how they work and the best one for you and your skin is really, really important because as much as it can make a positive change, it can also go horribly wrong. Uh, and I've seen a lot of clients that have over exfoliated their skin or actually their skin, they're using the wrong exfoliant completely for their skin type or their skin concern. And they've ended up with more damage than they had previously. So it's really, really important to pick the right one, which is why I thought I'd do this video today, my guide to exfoliants. So let's dive right in. So there's two main types of exfoliants. Obviously within each category, there's many, many subcategories. There's hundreds of products, probably millions of products within each category. Um, but the two main categories are physical exfoliants and chemical exfoliants. So physical exfoliants are granular, gritty, scrubs, polishes, those exfoliants that you can feel on your skin. So they're gonna be exfoliants that you are actually gonna scrub on the surface of your skin. You're gonna feel the grit, you're gonna feel the exfoliant working into your skin. They're great for acne prone skins, for young teen skins, really, really good for like body polishes and things like that because it really helps to exfoliate that slightly harder skin on your body. But the main, main thing about physical exfoliants is they can leave you a bit of redness. So if you've got sensitive skin, skin that's prone to sensitivity, redness, dehydration, then I would say physical exfoliants aren't gonna be the one for you. What they're basically doing is taking off that top layer of dead skin, which is just sitting on the surface, but they're not actually treating the lower layers of skin, which is where you really wanna be exfoliating. You wanna be getting right down to the base where actually you're gonna see those dramatic changes in not just right now, but also in weeks to come when those skin cells work their way up to the surface. So with physical exfoliants, I would always say very, very good for teen skins, really, really good if you've got like blackheads and things on your chin and nose. But actually for most skin conditions, I would always opt for the second category, which is chemical exfoliants. So chemical exfoliants are my favorite type of exfoliants. I love these kind of exfoliants. There are so many different types. You have oils, gels, creams, moisturizers, serums, chemical peels, at-home peels, there's loads of different types of this particular category, which is why it's such an amazing thing. So you can be applying a moisturizer, which has a chemical exfoliant within it, and actually your moisturizer becomes your exfoliant, which is super exciting. You miss out a step, and if you're super lazy like me, and you don't want to be putting on 10 different types of creams, you just want it all done in a minute, then something like that is amazing. You have gel ones, which you can apply at home, like a gel, and actually that exfoliates your skin, and then you wash it off after 10 minutes. You also have things like chemical peels, I mean, I do a lot of like glycolic, salicylic, mandelic acid. Oh my gosh, there's so many different ones, but there's lots of different chemical peels that I do in clinic where I literally just apply the acid to the skin, leave it on for a set amount of time and then remove it. Um, and that's also part of the chemical exfoliant category as well. So one of my favorite types of chemical exfoliants is vitamin A. So vitamin A, um, you guys would have known if you come to see us at Skincare, is one of my favorite ingredients. It's one of Maria's favorite ingredients as well. We absolutely love vitamin A. You basically apply it onto the skin in the form of a moisturizer usually or a serum and the vitamin A has uh, got many many different derivatives many many different types you've got retinols you've got retin A you've got pure vitamin A all of the different types do slightly different things but vitamin A as a whole exfoliates your skin so you can actually apply that moisturizer and it's going to exfoliate your skin it's going to leave you a brighter smoother skin and you don't need a physical exfoliant you can skip out the scrubs altogether and you can just go cleanse tone moisturize and you've done six step skincare routine in three steps. So really, really clever. You've also got types like enzymes and things as well, which you can apply onto the skin. Again, leaving on for a set amount of time, maybe three minutes. One of my favorite versions of this is the Rapid Reveal Peel from Dermalogica. So that one, you pop on, you leave on for either six to 12 minutes, depending on how resilient your skin is. You leave it on, you let it soak in, and actually that has an amazing, amazing, brightening, instant effect on the skin. And that is without any friction. You're not rubbing away at the skin, you're not scrubbing 
showing at the skin and that is safe for you know retinol users and really high level of vitamin A users as well. So that's my guide to exfoliants. I hope you guys really enjoyed that. Like I say, there's the two main types, physical and chemical. As with everything, there's always loads of different subcategories within that, but hopefully that's given you a nice broad overview of your guide to exfoliants. If you want to learn a bit more about exfoliants or learn a little bit more about your skin, you can book in for an online or an in-face consultation with us via WhatsApp or FaceTime uh, on our website, or you can shop any of the products that we mentioned today at www.shop.windsorskincare.co.uk. Thanks so much for watching guys, and we will catch up with you soon. Okay, thanks, bye.